Hello, Painting with a Purpose friends. Um, we're going to get started on a super cute Easter painting. So the brushes that you're going to need are your two inch flat brush. Oops, dropped one. Your small flat brush. You're also going to need your small and medium round brush. So the colors that you're going to need is a background color. I'm going to use this blue mixed with white. You're going to need some pastel colors. So like light blue, teal, pink, um, even a light purple if you have it, that would be good. Some shades of green, yellow. You're gonna need some black, gray, and white. So get all those things and let's get painting. So our background is gonna be that, just a little bit of blue mixed with white and it's gonna cover three fourths of your canvas. And I may go over this with white. It may be too dark of a blue. I think I'm going to just too blue for me. I just want it very faint a very, very, very light blue. And we're going to do three fourths. I think I'm going to add some more white to it. I just put one little drop of blue when I mix this color. Sure does go a long way. All right. So now that we have that, go ahead and wipe your brush off. And we're gonna go to our lightest green color. And we're gonna paint this last little bit of our canvas this light green. Just like so. Now we're gonna let this dry. All right. Now that our background is dry, let's get down to business. I gotta move my heater a little closer. It's freezing in the basement. Okay, here we go. I don't think I told you that you're gonna need a skin color, but you will need a skin color. And how I make my skin color is a little bit of tan, so brown and white mixed together. Um and pink a little bit of pink you guys are gonna love this all right we're gonna start with our medium round brush and we're gonna start with our white paint and we're just gonna make like a little kind of like teardrop but it doesn't really close all the way, right in the middle of our canvas. And we're just gonna fill this in with white. His white beard, we're just gonna kinda Feather out the edges. And we're gonna wipe the white off. Wipe it off really good. You may even wanna rinse it a little bit. And then we're gonna come in here with our black. And he has these cute little black shoes that sit right here. And it's like straight across the bottom. And then they just kind of round up. He's got these really big gnome feet. So again, it's straight across the bottom. And then round up. All right, now let's make them even and fill them in.
All right, rinse the black off. We're gonna come in here with your gray and add some little detail to his beard. There is his beard. Wipe your brush. And with your teal paint, that teal color, a fiber color, we're gonna make his hat. And it just kind of swings down, bumps up, and swings down. Oops. Bumps up where his nose is going to sit and then swings back down. Actually, I'm going to switch to my small flat brush. I think it'll be easier and it'll fill in quicker. And then from here, goes up and curves this way. So your round brush is really good for um, beard and texturizing things, but really a brush, um, your flat brush is really good for drawing and filling in. All right, we have his nice big gnome hat. And we're gonna rinse that brush. And we're gonna go back to our round brush. And we're gonna put some Easter eggs in the grass. So maybe we're gonna have a yellow painted Easter egg. And the Easter eggs are smaller at the top and then as they come down they get a little bit bigger. And with our skin color, we're gonna come in here and do our gnome nose, and it's a little oval. 
So it's right up there in the curve of the hat. There's our little nose. Wipe that off. And we're gonna give him a pink Easter egg that he is holding. So it kind of sets right in between his feet. And I actually think, go ahead and rinse the pink off. We're gonna change this yellow egg to blue because the yellow didn't really show up in the green. So let's make this egg blue. wiped paint on my face um, let's do his little bunny ears if his hat's dry oh. we're gonna wait for his beard to dry the eggs to dry and the hat to dry now that his hat's dry his eggs are still a little wet uh, but his hat is dry so we're gonna move on to his hat so we're gonna start with our pink and he's gonna get bunny ears. It's so cute, I can't stand it. And they're gonna set right above his nose. And this one goes out this way. Let's fill that in. out this way and it's gonna be kind of bent over so we're not gonna see a lot of the pink we're gonna see Set this brush aside and get your small round brush and your gray paint. And we're gonna outline this pink with gray.
grab your medium brush. We're gonna darken up this pink. Set that brush aside. I'm gonna go over some of this gray again. Just. Okay, wipe that gray off. And with your yellow, we're gonna do a few little designs on this egg. So you can do some circles. Rinse that off. We're gonna grab our medium round brush and we're gonna add some grass texture to our grass. So I've got a couple different colors of grass. Um, I'm gonna come in with a light first and just add some like blades. back in with a little bit of a darker color. And then put that brush in the water. With your teeny tiny round, we're going to come in with that darkest green and we're just going to add you here and there.
There is your cute Easter Bunny gnome. I cannot wait to see what you create.